Let's understand the difference between positive and normative economics. Now, what happens is that in economics, there are two ways of studying the mechanism. There are various mechanisms which are in place in an economy. You know, we saw something relating to the buying and selling earlier. There was a mechanism in place in which what happened was that there were buyers and there were sellers. Okay. Now the buyer used to go to the seller and make his purchases and pay him the money. The seller in turn might be procuring the goods from a factory. So economic basically studies as to what are the various mechanisms through which the basic problems in an economy are being satisfied. Okay. What happens in a positive and a normative economics is that let's say we had this mechanism of buying and selling. So in positive economics, what we understand is how are the different mechanisms functioning to achieve, to address the basic problems in an economy. So if you are buying, you are selling, how is the market functioning? Let's say, if, let's say you have all these retail stores, multi-brand retail stores these days, big retail stores. So an economist will study, how are these retail stores working? Okay. So you have these big chains, X, Y, Z. So economist studies, how are these functioning and how are these also affecting the small mom and pop shops? You know, what is their mechanism? How do they do the procurement? How do they sell? What's the profit that they are making? Normative economic studies, whether these mechanisms are desirable or not. The retail stores, definitely, they benefit the consumer. You don't need to go to 10 places to buy your stuff. You get everything under the same consume, same place. Plus, price-wise perspective, also they are good. Plus, you get fresh products. There are many advantages of retail stores. But, if you see, they may, in, they may also affect the mom and pop shows. Because, once the retail store happens, their sales go down. May or may not. So in normative economics, whether, what we study is, whatever is happening in an economy, some changes are happening, are these desirable or not? Whereas in a positive economy, we study what are the different mechanisms and how they are functioning.